Hi guys, it's Gav here in the wood. Um, I just wanted to make a um, wee video about the right image. What do I mean by that? Well, um, it's given in, um, there's even an indication given in, uh, through Steiner in relationship to the thyroid chakra, this one here. So there's eight petals of that chakra that need to be enlivened and one of them is right image. Imagine <laughs> when you reflect on your day how much you use the, uh, the wrong image during your day. So um, I think one of the things is to kind of remember what it was like when you were a child, when you were using imagery. It was believable. And to get back into that state. That, um, until, you, until you become like little children, you will not know the kingdom. Um, that kind of quality of belief in your images. And usually constructive life building images and it enables you to manifest whatever you desire um, and you can see how it's connected to it's a, a, quite a difficult thing to do in our materialistic age is work with these Right images. First of all, we've destroyed our imagination, and secondly, it's like most people go, "What's the point in not holding an image anyway?" Sort of thing. Uh, um, so it's having that kind of belief in it, that quality of that holding quality of the image that brings it into um, the physical world and that's what's so fantastic about it it's so easy to talk about it's a different thing to practice because it really relies on you bringing the strength to it nobody else can do it for you and that's another thing that's fantastic about it because it comes out of freedom, your choice. So, thanks for listening, and remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.